There's a huge brouhaha about Snapchat and how its filters are possibly discriminatory or racist. Uh, now, this has to do with the fact that their filters could lighten your image or could even make your face seem narrower or your nose seem more narrow. This is according to a few people who are upset about it on social media. Let me give you one example. Allegra Kark says, Snapchat, I'm very disturbed by the fact that your beautification filters make my skin lighter and my nose and jaw smaller. Just saying. Now, this is something that I noticed not only with Snapchat, but um, my Android back in the day had a beauty filter already set in the camera settings. Um, it was automatic? It was, I don't know, maybe I Wait, accidentally. Do all Androids set it. have that? Am I not as beautiful as I think Probably I am? not. Um, no, I'm just kidding. But it was weird because of like, I don't, something's kind of off. I don't really look like that. Um, and then I realized that there was like a beautification filter or beauty filter that does even your skin tone, but when it evens your skin tone, it tends to lighten it as well. Yeah, that's why people often say that I look pale. It's just the filters, man. Yeah. I am like a bronze god. Oh, yeah. Totally. In real life. Oh, yeah. Um, all right, so let's show you an example. Uh, one person at Yahoo uh, tried this out, and you can see what the filter looks like. Did it lighten her skin? It looks like it saturated her skin. It's like colorful now. Uh, it does, I mean, it's it obviously. Did, it does look like it manipulated her nose. Yeah, it manipulated her nose. It made, I can't really tell. Made her hair blue. I can't really tell because it's not really the same picture, but. Um, I think her head is thinner. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, so let me just address this very quickly. Is Ooh, are these oh, oh, anyway, sorry. Are these filters racist? No. No. Okay. What these filters do is perpetuate, you know, the standards of beauty that the fashion industry, the beauty industry keep pushing on us. I don't think it really has to do with race. I think it has to do with the idea that if you're thinner, if your nose is more narrow, you're more attractive, yeah. right? Although, and I mean, those stereotypes, in part, are derived from preferring the stereotypical looks of some races over others. Yeah, that's true, So too. it's not specifically racist, but it is part of a construct that has racism as part of its foundation. Yeah, and also, I just... What, I, what I'm actually more concerned about is the fact that it... If you... Back in the day, we would always argue that, like, oh, don't look at these images of models and magazines because they've been manipulated, they've been photoshopped. And then now that kind of culture has kind of transitioned to social media. Every so, picture. So, for instance, Instagram, right? Um, yeah, Instagram has filters that, you know, change the coloring of the image, but there are also filters that smooth out the image so you don't have the flaws shown anymore. Change the you... physical shape of things so people look skinnier than they actually are? Yes, they could change your physical shape. And so I think what's more important than anything is to educate young girls specifically about what the realities are of, you know, the people that they're following on social media. Because yeah. social media is very similar to mass media in that it adds a sparkle to the lives of individuals yeah. and it's not reality, okay? By the way, you look at my Instagram page and Anna Kasparian official, not a big deal. I mean, I'm not going to put an ugly picture of myself up there, right? Mm -hmm. I don't really I look like will, that. I <laughs> will, however, put ugly pictures of her up on mine. <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah. Um, yeah, so so you... I don't manipulate my images with, like, I don't know how to use Photoshop. I feel really embarrassed that I still but don't. But there's apps that will do that for you. They automatically find curves and change them and yes. stuff like that. Yes, so there yeah. are apps like that. I'm not sure what the names of the apps oh, I are. Don't know. I don't use those because I feel like it would be too freaking obvious. But do mm. I use filters on Instagram? You betcha. But yeah. you're but you're hashtag no filter. That's like your thing. That's the show. That, yeah, that's yeah. true. Uh, yes. So in that probably in the end, after years of doing that, probably makes it has some effect on you that, yeah. that all of your pictures look like that. And then for people who are following that, like they're on Instagram and they're seeing things, they won't know if they can trust what they're seeing. Like I follow um, the baby animals. Maybe those animals aren't as cute as they seem. Maybe they're not as sleepy as they appear in the videos. Maybe they're kind of alert, actually. And the filters make them look really sleepy and cute. Oh, they're so cute. Mm -hmm. I want to be able to trust the things that I see. And trust me, I follow a lot of fitness models on Instagram. Yeah. Do they actually look anything like those pictures? I don't know. But I'll find out.